Bucks, we're about to close out a make or break month for retailers, but January is shaping up to be pretty important too. Melissa Repko joins us now with more. Melissa, good morning. Good morning, Kayla. January performance is often overlooked after a busy holiday season, but this year it could decide which retailers put up a strong quarter or a disappointing one. It'll also set the tone for 2023. One major factor to watch is discounting. Major retailers like Target and Lululemon started the season with higher inventory levels, thanks to an unexpected shift in consumer preferences over the summer. There could be more discounts ahead for companies that failed to shed those excess items this holiday season. Consumers are also expected to tighten their belts after holiday spending sprees. Holiday sales rose 7.6% year over year, according to data from MasterCard Spending Pulse. That's only slightly higher than the 7.1% annualized inflation growth that we saw in November. Some retailers could be in for a more pronounced pullback as Americans continue to cope with rising costs. Walmart, however, said it expects to see a boost in traffic in late December and January as, price, as shoppers become more price sensitive. And then there's the added benefit of people cashing in gift cards and making New Year's resolutions. Target's working to drum up sales with fresh merchandise in January, including a lot of workout clothes.